right now in this social media driven world so many people want to be seen without even pausing for a second y'all like Hey guys, this is A Renee from Journal Jot and Jive. If this is your first time stopping by the channel, welcome to the channel. If you are a returning subscriber, hey y'all. All right, y'all. So by the title, I feel like this is gonna be called Pause on Purpose and it's okay to journal. All right, I really feel like that's what this is gonna be. I'm not even quite sure if this is gonna be a long video. Um, I don't know, I, I, I don't know. So what we're gonna do is it may be a tad bit chatty, it may not, I, I do really feel like it's not gonna be that long, y'all. So let's start with a couple of things. I am creating a page in my journal. It's gonna be called Pause on Purpose. Uh, I did this phrase last year, actually. I did, and what I can say is, oh, I already have some scrapbooking paper down. Y'all, I, I started journaling this morning, a little early, after I burnt some toast, okay? I burnt some toast. So here's the story, okay? So I say, oh, I want some toast. So I ate two pieces of toast previously, okay? And so I was like, oh, that toast was good. I think I want two more pieces. And so for many of you all, uh, you know that I'm on a fitness journey. And um, with that fitness journey, there's no reason, no rhyme or reason that I should even be trying to eat four pieces of toast ever in my lifetime. And so, you know, I buttered that toast on up, I put it in the toaster oven, and I forgot about it, okay? I forgot about it, I forgot about it. Y'all, this whole house is smelling like burnt toast. Uh, I don't ever know if you've ever burnt some toast, uh, but that smell is atrocious. So I'm gonna insert a little photo somewhere right here so you can see how bad. Lee, I burnt that toast. Your girl burnt the toast. So needless to say, the universe saved me of some calories that I didn't need, but it is now burning my nostrils, right? So I am recording this while my nostrils are burning. Uh, I did lift all the windows up. I had to turn the fan on, um, and I was so thankful that uh, the smoke alarm didn't go off. But uh, if you live in a two-story home or a three-story, you know that um, smells rise. So when I decided to take a walk up the stairs, oh, oh my, oh my, okay? So yeah, so I think I've already inserted that photo. So yeah, I did a good job on that, okay? Burnt that toast, who burns toast? Welcome to Monday Motivation. All right, y'all, so sorry, I just hit that with my hat. Um, so y'all, like, yesterday was a lot. Um, and I don't feel like I'm gonna talk a lot about yesterday because my view right now is a little different. <sighs> it was just a lot, y'all. It's a lot. And um, I believe that's why I'm gonna write on here, pause on purpose. Uh, many of you all have, and I'm, use, I'm using the word uh a lot, and y'all know that's not my jam. I, I really don't like to say uh that much. But I'm being very strategic on what I say, and it's not that I have a problem saying how I feel, but right now I feel like treading lightly may be the best course of action. Um, because I feel like right now in this social media driven world, So many people want to be seen without even pausing for a second, y'all. Like, and the irony in this all, on Friday, I think it was Friday, I mentioned that the next topic, uh, journal prompt topics, would be social media. It's going to be called Dear Social Media, and I could not imagine that the event that occurred yesterday would actually further the purpose of the dear social media journal prompts that we will all be um, working on if you choose to buy them. And, and honestly, after watching a lot of you all, y'all need to buy these journal prompts. Um, so again, this quick journal, oh yeah, like this is a heavy one. 
I am so happy that I have a therapy session today because y'all, I went back and forth yesterday with wanting to post something, but I had to check myself and say, what benefit of me posting right now? What would be the benefit? And would it fall on deaf ears and eyes? And, and right now in the social climate, it would have fallen on deaf ears and eyes. So, your girl, I had to literally, y'all, pause. Mm hmm. Go ahead and write this because y'all know I will mess up a word. I had to pause on purpose, okay? Um, Y'all know me. Define a word. I encourage everybody that's watching this video to define the word pause, okay? Make it applicable to where it fits in your life, but just look up the word pause. Uh, yeah, look up the word pause. And I feel like a lot of us can learn from just being still sometimes for a moment, if only for a day or more. So pause on purpose. That's where I'm feel. This is the Monday motivation that I have for a lot of you all. Um, just be mindful. Be mindful of what you say and how you say it and why you're saying and what you plan to gain from it. Uh, I encourage you to journal. Jur journal. Before you peck on a keyboard or your phone, um, open a book. Brain dump your thoughts. Write exactly how you feel. Read it back to yourself. And say, self, if I post this, what is the overall gain? And I encourage a lot of you all to just pause, y'all. Pause, pause on purpose. I don't even have a whole bunch of words to put behind this because, again, I, I know I have to be strategic. And at some point, I may bring this back up and I may not. Um... I just, I just wish the world that we lived in learned what it means to pause um, instead of wanting to be first. Cause that, this wanting to be first hurts a lot of people in the process. All right, y'all. So that's that. Okay, so I'm just gonna do a little bit of, you know, sprucing the page up so it can pop off the page. Oh, okay, so let's let's get a little lighter. Let's get a little lighter. Learn what you wanted to from that. That's all I got for you right now. So most of you all know that I had to get my eye procedure done Friday. So it's done. And I still have quite a bit of swelling. I am a little nervous because, you know, you don't know for sure if it's going to go completely away. Ooh, we're going to say this silent prayer that it goes completely away. So it's still swelling. It's still draining. Um. So, yeah, y'all like... I had to tell homeboy, oh, that kind of hurt a little bit. Okay, so if you are first joining y'all, I had a Chalazion. And I may write the word Chalazion across the screen so you can look it up. I don't know if you have a stomach for it. That's fine. If you don't, don't go look it up. But in essence, it's basically a cyst on my eye. Well, under my eyelid. And what it is is my oil glands build up and they don't always drain like they should. And so I had like a, um, a visible bump on my eyelid that made me very insecure. And you know, some people just out of love or out of curiosity be like, oh my God, you got a star on your eye. And I'm like, oh gosh, yeah, I would like shrivel on the inside. Like, no, ah. but anyway, so I had the surgery, had some great doctors. And so the surgery overall, yeah, I have a very, 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 very uh, high tolerance of pain. So I got a series of maybe eight shots in my eye, upper eyelid, lower eyelid. Um, and so then they have to, oh, disclaimer, if you get squeamish, speed on up. 
Um, so they had to like numb my eye basically. So some local anesthesia, and I'm awake by the way, okay? There's no putting me under for this, I'm awake. And so they shot me in my eye a couple of times, boom. Let it numb a little bit, but here's, here, here, here's the kicker. They have to flip your eyelid and then clamp it like with the metal like screw type thing. And, um, you know, I was doing real well, you know, feeling like a piece of hairs in my eye. But when that joker had to kind of keep screwing that thing, and I was like, he was like, oh, you should feel a little pressure. You might feel a little. I said, oh, no, no, no. That hurt. Ouch. So, you know, they finally did it. But y'all, listen, that procedure took less than 10 minutes. I am curious to see this medical bill that comes attached to that. So, dear I, can you stop it? Because we ain't here for... We ain't really here to keep getting this eye flipped up and screwed open, okay? So yeah, y'all, I did that. So I'm glad that I was able to get that done. That was one of my goals on my list. So we just need this healing to go accordingly because your girl not trying to get this eye flipped back up, okay? They gonna have to shoot me with a steroid in the eye or something because uh-uh. Now I can be a trooper, but I ain't trying to be a trooper again for that. So that was that. Overall, my weekend went pretty well. Um, it wasn't too bad. Uh, like I said, until yesterday, that was just a, mm, a lot. So today I have a therapy session. You know, yeah, I'm thankful. So I'll be doing that this afternoon. My son and I will go to our, we'll work out. This week I had to adjust my gym schedule with my trainer so I'll only be working out there for two weeks I mean two weeks for two days and then I'll actually go into LA Fitness this week that's not my jam but sometimes you have to adjust to your finances so that's what I'll be doing I'll actually go into LA Fitness on the opposing days that I'm not working out with my trainer and so that's where that discipline comes in so this should be fun so yeah that's that y'all I don't really think I'm about to stay on here that much longer, y'all, because I just feel like if I do, I'm going to want to revisit the other topic. And as I said, I need to pause on purpose. So I'm going to finish drawing these little extra lines. And I think that's going to be that. Again, my motivation to you on this Monday morning is to pause on purpose. Pull out your journal, write how you feel, whatever emotions you are feeling before you run to social media, run to your journal and think about others. Don't always think about yourself first. Okay. So y'all have an amazing, amazing, amazing Monday. Um, yeah, I know this ain't y'all usual video, but <laughs> that's all I got for y'all today. So until next time.